2K, I ain't even gonna hold y'all, bro. I ain't even gonna hold y'all, man. This, this right here is actually quite funny. I, I'm not even gonna cap. It's quite funny. Now, I'm not saying the design don't look nice, because, of course, that's really all motherfuckers at 2K can do nowadays is design something to look nice. They can doctor up some footage to look nice. They can doctor up a picture to look nice, but they can't doctor up no gameplay for the game to play nice. I say all that to say this. Of all the people that we saw this past year play basketball, y'all put Luka Doncic's son as the cover boy. Now, I know people say, well, you could have put Luka Doncic. Luka was on the cover of the last game. I can understand that. And I'm not trying to disrespect Devin Booker his game. I'm not trying to do that at all because Devin Booker could damn sure play basketball better than me. He got more money in his bank account than I have right now. And he's, he's a basketball star. He is. But to say he's a cover boy, after seeing him and the Phoenix Suns get bitched by Luka Doncic in the playoffs, y'all didn't put, no, don't put a Joel Embiid, don't put a two-time MVP in, in, in Nikola Jokic, don't put Steph Curry, the reigning finals MVP, put Devin Booker, the guy that got bitched. Wow. All I got to say is wow. You put Luka Doncic's son as the cover boy. <laughs> no Steph Curry. Hell, it's 2K23. You got Michael on the Legend Edition. It's 2K23. Why was LeBron? LeBron would have been a better pick. But y'all put the guy that got bitched by Luka Doncic. Cover boy. <sighs> I can't even say I'm surprised, 2K. Typical 2 Classic 2K. Never listening to the fans, never really paying attention to what's going on in basketball. They're just making some shit with a basketball logo and calling it a product. I'm out.